Hello guys, and um, welcome back uh, to the Bonds PGC, the Richard the Red the Flame, and for some reason, uh, a bond. I think the final battle. Um, yeah, I wasn't in the final battle, but then, so I was 100% HP, so it doesn't mean that I'm in the third phase now, where he's about to. to your BB gauge buffs at 50% HP and then buff himself with that. I'm not sure as well, just gonna continue. And yeah. So next turn I'm gonna use uh, CBB. I think I want CBB is much more more appropriate since you can get the full BB gauge on attack buff. Yeah, I'll use uh, CBB. It's always at 50% HP. We'll just have to see. Since I don't have two more rebounds left. Maybe I think this is the final phase. He didn't do his buff quite right, though. At the start when he Yeah, that's just that's so I'm gonna go down here. And the bird so If this is it, then yeah. Alright. Alright. So just an even like this please. Nice. That's what I'm looking for. I was I was that that's what I was waiting for. The POE. Nice arc. Alright, so I'm gonna use arc since we need to. Let's see VV. Just got a battle. Let's see. Let's see if this is the part where Avant removes your BBH after you see BB. And buffs as well. So that's the threshold where Avant removes your buffs and your BBH. If this is it, then we are almost close to the end. Right. It's purifying flame. Yep, yeah, it's that's the buff. I think so, yeah. Purifying flame. So now I'll use a fusion on Magris. So I'll use Arcs SBB. Guard everyone. There's a book. Not that too painful. Alright, now we have to use CVB when his HP is 25%. Now he buffs himself to attack a buff, so let's try to refill that BBH. So it only last for 3 turns, guys, so don't worry. Let's use one. Works. I'm just gonna use normal attack, I guess. So I need to fill my PV page. Then his HP is at 30%. I don't know if I might die here, but we'll see. Oh man, no, I died yet. Yeah. Alright, no, doesn't matter since you have four more revives. Let's use our XPD to heal everyone. Go ahead, everyone. I think we have two times mitigation. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Two turns mitigation from Magris. Yes. So I'm just gonna grab the bird and attack. So 30% HP without to use CBB again. And this time I will use Arc CBB. Oh, the bird. Oh, come on, Alan, don't die again. Alright, Alan get forks targeted. Well, it doesn't matter since we still have three more revives. The attack buff will wear off in last turn. So, for now, I'm just gonna keep guarding Alan. No. 
Let's just do it. Let's do an SPB. One arc. I need macros to do some negation here. So I'm gonna go to double root. Once more. Again, another one. Ah, uh, yeah, the attack buff is gone now. So Alan should be able to survive the next turn. He doesn't get focus targeted by it. Uh, what? That is... Ooh! Now he died again. Alright. Two more revives. I think we're just using all the revives in Alan. Now I'm gonna use our SPB. And just keep building Alan, as usual. And SPB. This is BB. So let's start auto battle with it. Guard the bird. Burn this BB. Actually, you can see the dick you just got it. It's not that. We're almost at 35%. Oh, I'm gonna die this wheel. Off moving attack. Coming. That was nice. I want you to hit arc. Yes! That's what I like. That's what I like. But arc might die here. Ooh! Oh man, the damage. Alright, I'm gonna <laughs> keep guarding the here. Now we're just gonna attack. I'm gonna just keep guarding the bird. So he will say a dialogue, yeah. and that's when he's about to nuke your units. But you can survive it if you just guard your units and use magnus mitigation, I think. So I'm gonna use Arc SPB here to get ready for the nuke. Guard Aldalon again, and let's use uh, the birds SPB. Oh shit! So use SPB. Or we may might be able to kill them in the next turn. Let's see. So I'm gonna I'm gonna I don't know. I'm gonna make a bet here. Shoot. Yeah, I'm gonna make a bet here. So let's see if there's gonna be So I'm gonna take the risk. Defense buff, defense increases. Let's let's just make. Let's just do this. Yeah. So I'm going to auto battle my units so I can push the damage down ten percent, and the nuke will not happen if I can push the damage down ten percent. Spark. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's a new Holy shit. The bird might die. Whoa, ho, ho, ho. Somehow I survived without you, BB. Alright, hold on. Oh, yes, they. The bird and Alan didn't get focus targeted. So we have a chance here. Yeah. I think we can we win it with the UBB. Let's see. There was a new guy, see, he was vaporizer attack. And I survived it with the light barrier and navigation. Well so you don't really need a critical immunity like this. We still have one revive guys. Uh, I'm guessing Vern and Sidon might survive since they're the only water units and Arc as well. Another deals vaporizer nuke. 
had uh, pawns would die if one's HP is at 10%. I'll just gonna let the bird die there. Since we, we almost beaten a bot here. Or I could use a crescent shoe. Yeah, let's just use a crescent shoe. Alright, there we go. So let's finish this GG zoom off. Now I should have recorded. I don't know. No. Record uh, the bird, I guess. Yeah. So even if uh, the bird rather than dies here, we can kill Vaunt in this turn. Yeah, we did, guys. We beat a Vaunt with the mitigation. Um, 3% HP, yeah. All the fourth scatter is gonna die in this turn. It's gonna disappear. Yes. Yep, guys, that's how you beat the boss GGC. That was pretty quick. Yeah. And yeah, that was. That was. That was. Really. Um, time consuming as well. But it's. Yeah, it's possible. It's possible to be the bond without critical immunity from Tarna or Dance. As long as you have two units that give mitigation of their skill, you will be fine. And a light barrier. Bar any barrier buff. Uh, except Earth Barrier. Barrier buff and elemental mitigation and. A bunch of GGC will be a piece of cake for you guys, yeah. That's, and yeah, that's how you beat the fast GGC, guys. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.